There's two Joey Logano's. There's a, the nice guy that's sitting right here to my left. And then there's that dog when he puts on that helmet. And bro, when you when you put your helmet on and you turn into that different guy, it's amazing to watch. How important has it been to get those wins out early to be advanced into the next round early and then be able to set up right now for Phoenix for like the last three weeks? Yeah, I mean, it, there's a true advantage there in so many different ways. But to be able to start thinking ahead and a couple weeks before everyone, right? When we were in Vegas, in victory lands like okay well now we know what we got to do like the next two weeks don't matter at all like mm -hmm. we need to take this advantage that we earned and actually make something of it which means we have to go to work on one race car on one thought process on how do we get our phoenix car as fast as we can how do we get our practice plan ready to go how do we want to handle qualifying how do we want to you know what's the different options we can play the race out at there's a lot of different things um and even goofy things that people don't think about like logistics right a lot of people want to go to the race yeah. all of a sudden everyone your phone starts ringing hey i want to come to phoenix i want to come here right so you can get okay i can get a suite now i know like okay everyone has a place to go how am i gonna get my family out there like i thought about all this stuff already because now this week is so busy and it's short you don't have a lot of time to prep and think about those things so the two-week advantage is really adds up to be something well, you talked about the size of the team, the organization, all the men and women that, that mean so much to win a championship for. Most of those or all of those now have two shots at the championship with you and Ryan Blaney. What is it going to be like going to race a teammate, right? I mean, he's your teammate. He's the defending champ. He hasn't had the couple weeks head start you have. But now two teams, two Fords, both out of Team Penske heading to Phoenix. How does that change the dynamic? Uh, it, it doesn't change it a whole bunch because we work together. I mean, that's that's why we're here. That's how we got here. Um, so it doesn't really change much, right? We want to be able to deliver for Team Penske for Roger, like I said. So does it? It doesn't really change a whole bunch. Um, now, I mean, obviously, we both want to be the one that pulls it into victory lane. Like, I mean, let's be honest. There, there is always Nobody that. wants to get beat by, like, their brother. No, right? like, no, no, like, I want to be the best in the family. Yeah. yeah. But one of our cars needs to win. Yeah. Right? I mean, that's, yeah. that's the bottom line. Um, and you hope it to be you, obviously. Um, but if we can't win, that's the car you want to win. Um, so hopefully we can, you know, together make all that happen. We are stronger together. We've proven that over the years. So you can't break that now because there's more on the line. You can't, you can't come off of what made you successful. Uh, you know, Ryan was in here and he said that that first one, you know, you want it so bad, but the second one, you want it even worse. And now you've gone through that process. The third one, what's the emotion attached to, to number three? I think they're all the same, to be honest, which is, is there's no moment that you can compare to than winning a championship in sports. And that's why I like watching championship games in other sports. It's just because you see that raw emotion, and there's only a select few amount of people in the world that can relate and know yeah. what that's like. Right? Like, getting married is awesome. Having kids was awesome. But it's in a different category, right? It's equally awesome, but it's just it's yeah. so different. And you know it's coming, right? You can prepare for having a kid. It's not a surprise, right? Like, maybe it is at some point, but not at the end, at least. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh married. Yeah. Everybody gets married. Everybody. You know, it's like a, you know it's coming. You prepare for it. And you know the day's coming. Like, yeah, we're preparing for Phoenix, but we don't know we're going to win. Right. And you don't know it until you cross the line. And that life time dream since you were a little kid, right, is never to be a NASCAR driver, is to be a NASCAR champion. And so when you achieve that, and you cross the line, those emotions, I mean, they hit you hard. That is the moment that you work for.